an iPod or smartphone as the source for your music has become the norm for stereo systems on a boat. But a marine environment can be pretty harsh on an electronic device. What do you do with it to keep it safe while you're listening to music? If you are using Bluetooth to connect your device wirelessly to the stereo, then you can just keep it in your pocket. But even then, there may be times when you don't have pockets or you need to recharge your phone. Let's take a look at the options for storing your device on your boat. If your boat has a glove box, that might be a good place to put it. Many stereos will have the device connections on the back, so you can just run an extension behind the console to the glove box where you can plug it in and keep it safe and sound. If you don't have a glove box, there are separate docks available like this one. You would set it up the same way in that you would run the wires behind the dash to the dock. The drawback there is that the dock will take up additional space on your console or dash. Many new stereos like this one have a device dock built into it instead of a CD player. The face flips down to reveal the dock. This one has a standard size chassis so it'll fit where a stereo with a CD player would. Of course, the downside to all of these solutions we have discussed so far is that you can't see your device while it is plugged in. One alternative is a stereo like this one with a transparent door so you can see the screen while your phone is protected. This type of setup requires a completely different type of installation, so you will have to take that into account, especially if you are doing a replacement. If you are more concerned about protecting your device rather than where you will put it, you might look into a protective case like this one. This not only prevents water from getting into it, but it will protect it from shock if it gets dropped. The other one is made of thick transparent vinyl, which not only allows you to see your screen, but you can operate the buttons too. It doesn't offer a lot of shock protection though. Check out our other videos for more information about using an iPod or smartphone with your marine stereo.